Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new Tech Reviews and Gadgets episode where today we're reviewing a multifunctional alarm clock charging station. And you guys are currently watching Clearly. today's episode, we're viewing a charging station that has four USB ports, two AC ports, and it's also an alarm clock. But you know, it's kind of cool that it's like a table alarm clock, but it's also like a PAL um, extension cable because you can plug in all your different devices, you know, charge up your phone, charge up your tablet, and also use it as an alarm clock to wake up in the morning. So there's a lot of practical uses for this multifunctional um, charging station. But before we actually get started with this tech reviews and gadgets episode, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts when we do upload. Have any questions or concerns, leave a comment, enjoy the video, leave a like, and also show this video out to anybody who may be interested in a charging station alarm clock. And then also, if you guys actually wanna check out this product or get more details or specifications about this product, um, product information, details, and stuff will be down below in the description for those who are interested, alongside with the link to make a purchase if you're interested in buying this little charging station. But right now, what we're gonna do is actually move over to the first look and unboxing portion of this video. So as you guys can see, the overall packaging of this product is fairly simple. There's a few specifications and details on the side, but we're gonna take a closer look at that with a secondary camera angle. So on the top of the box, it just says table lamp multifunction smart plug. I don't know why it says table lamp, and it just says the same thing on all the sides with all the different specifications, but I'll flip onto the back sides to show you guys all the different features and different um, parameters that you may be interested in taking a look at. But right now, let's actually just proceed to unbox this box. So it looks like we have the charging station right here. This is our manual. So this will give you guys a few specifications and details on how to use this charging station. But let's take a look at the charging station itself. It is made out of plastic, but it seems pretty durable for the most part. This cable right here is about six feet long, so you guys can easily have this plugged away from a distance and not have it too close to you. So that's also really nice. We do have an on an off switch on the back side. We have our two AC ports in the middle right there. And we have our four USB quick charging ports. On this side, there's actually a digital screen. Once we power this up, you guys will be able to see the screen light up. But that looks like to be it. Also on the bottom, we actually have, it looks like a speaker right here. And we also have a battery um, compartment. So if you wanted to, you don't need to actually plug this into the AC port. You can use uh, utilize two AA batteries if you want to power up this alarm clock with that method if you wanted to. What we're gonna do now is actually just proceed to the testing and demonstration portion of this video. So let me actually um, untie this cable and plug it into our power supply. And once you have the cable unwrapped, what I'm gonna do is actually plug this into our power supply. And I just plugged it in. Ooh, it just beeped, okay. <laughs> that was interesting. And you guys can see it's currently on and you guys can see that it actually has a time set already on right now. I think the first thing that we're gonna start off with is actually plugging something into the AC port. So let me plug this in right here. I'm gonna plug in this table lamp that I have and see if it will get powered on. So as you guys can see, this is being powered up by this um, alarm clock um, charging station. So it's doing a fantastic job. So at least we know the AC ports work, but now let me test out one of the USB ports. So now let me plug in uh, my phone into one of the USB ports that we have just to see if it actually can power on. So let me plug in my phone. There we go. And now we're gonna take my phone and see if it will start charging. There we go. So it's charging up my phone. It's doing a fantastic job. And you guys can see I can utilize the AC ports or I can use my USB ports to charge up a lot of different devices all at the same time. So at least we know our different charging ports work. And now let's take a look at the alarm clock feature. This is going to be interesting. As you guys can see, the clock is on at the moment. 
Um, I do actually recommend you guys do put batteries into this because if the power goes off, it will have that memory function and it will save your alarm clock and also your time so you don't have to reconfigure that. If I hold down this alarm clock button, it's gonna start flicking. So now, if I use the up and down buttons, I should be able to change the time. And you guys can see it's changing the time, just like so. And right now we have it in PM. And approximately where I live right now, and as the time I'm shooting this, it's approximately 7 p.m. And I think if I click it again, it should stop. So now it's going into the minutes, and it looks like it's 7.18 right now. There we go. And as you guys can see, now I have the alarm clock set to the right time. We have a demo and snooze. So if I click on this, this LED um, interface should go dim. There we go. You guys can see it's getting dim. That's basically off. Interesting. So you could actually turn it off that way, but still have the clock actually be on. So in order to actually change this to Fahrenheit or Celsius, all you got to do is press down on the button, on the down button, and you guys can see now it's in Fahrenheit, and it says it's about 75 degrees Fahrenheit. If I click it or hold it down again, you guys can see now it went back into Celsius. So that's how you change it to Fahrenheit and Celsius. So in order to actually turn on the alarm of this um, charging station, all you gotta do is actually click down on the alarm clock. So before we were holding down to change the time, but if you just run, uh, click one time, that's what will actually activate our alarm. So as I click on it, you guys can see now we have our alarm controls and now I can set the time. So since we're testing this out, we're gonna do, uh, let's see. Oh, it looks like it's a military time. And now we're gonna switch it, let's say 721, so it can go off right now. Now the alarm clock should go off any moment now. And let's see once it does, let's see what sound effect it does. And let's see if the snooze button actually works. So let's just wait and see. And you guys can see we have the alarm bell on, so that tells you that the alarm clock is on and ready to go. You guys can see it's beeping, and it looks like it just beeps. It's pretty loud though. Okay, so it does speed up. Let's see if it will get louder or if it will start. Yep, it's beeping faster now. Okay, <laughs> it's getting really fast now. All right, I'm gonna snooze this now. And if I click in the middle button, you guys can see it stops the alarm clock, but it actually just snoozes it. So I believe to turn off the alarm clock, you just actually have to click on the alarm button and it turns off completely. So now the alarm is actually completely off. And if I click it again, you guys can see it has the same time that I had on originally. But overall, it did a fantastic job. And what we're gonna do right now is actually move over to the final opinions and remarks and end off this video. So what are my final opinions and remarks about this alarm clock charging station little thing, you know, I don't, there's a lot of different multi-functionalities that this little charging station has. Not only is it an alarm clock, it's also a clock, and not only is it an alarm clock and a clock, it also is a charging station. You know, I can plug in six different devices through this charging, you know, station kind of thing. I don't even know, there's so many different uses for it. But yeah, it's, it did a fantastic job, you know, we tested out, it charged my phone, was able to power up that table LED lamp we had. So everything works perfectly fine with this little charging station. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tech reviews and gadgets episode. And if you guys did, make sure you go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts when we do upload. Have any questions or concerns, leave a comment, enjoy the video, leave a like, and also share this video out to anybody who may be interested in some sort of charging station alarm clock combo. And then also, if you're a business owner or a company owner wanting to potentially work with us, our business inquiries email is careerelyt al.com. You guys can shoot me a message if you want to potentially work with me. Or if you need any photo assistance with this product, you guys can do so by contacting me through my business inquiries email. And then lastly, if you guys actually want to check out this product or get more detailed specifications or parameters about this product, that kind of stuff will be down below in the description for those who are interested in that kind of info, alongside with the link to make a purchase if you're interested in buying this exact product. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this installment of tech reviews and gadgets. 
I know I did making this episode, and I'll see you guys all on the next episode. Clearly signing off. Thank you guys all for watching, and have a good rest of your day.